What's going on everybody? This is Al from PlaybookGamer.com and in the last video we had a live stream and we played two games. First off we took on Rice, a team that we've struggled to beat this entire dynasty but as you could tell by the score we was able to pull off the win 24 to 17. From what I remember it's been a few days. I think they had some turnovers and we was able to take advantage of it and I don't think they had any impact guys in the backfield. That definitely helped. I'm just glad we won. Um, but as you can see, we're 11th in the country. We're 8 and 0. And we had another game in that live stream, and that was against Memphis. First time we played them in the dynasty. They are in the other division. We beat them pretty handily 38 to 14. No real issues there. So, like I said, we are 11th in the country. And today, I'm going to play just one game, and we're going to go up against East Carolina, ECU. I haven't played them any in this dynasty. I know they run like a spread offense, 4 3 defense. They usually have some really fast halfbacks in their backfield. We'll see. We'll check out when we uh, head into the game. But they're 2-5. and five. We got more talent than they do. It looks like they run the ball okay. The rest of that doesn't say a whole lot to me. So hopefully we can take care of business and continue winning. Now, we are done with recruiting. In that last video, we picked up our fourth and final commitment. These were the four guys that we went after all season and we were able to get all four but peter Jean is our latest commitment a four-star free safety really glad to get him in he is a day one starter then of course we got outside linebacker eric session he's probably a day one starter uh, taylor weber uh cornerback i'm not sure if he's a day one starter or not it's possible he could be we'll just see how the offseason recruiting plays out then last but not least aj robinson the strong safety so as you can see a theme is going on here all defensive players are really i'm trying to beef up that defense as best as i can and i think that we have done that with these four commitments now you look here on this screen we got 58 players coming back roughly we may have somebody want to go pro early or uh, want to transfer out but that gives us only 12 spots to fill we already have four commitments so now that gets it up to 62 so we really only have like eight spots to fill in the offseason so we're going to dump a ton of points in the training and i'm going to be very picky as to who i will get in the offseason but that's pretty coming up pretty soon we only got a few games left in this season all right let's go to sports illustrated Bowl rankings, I guess this matters to us. They had us 11th in the country. Now, they got us 14th in the bowl rankings, which I wasn't expecting that this year. I figured we'd lose maybe a couple games, but we've just had a really good season so far. Just really cool, and we'll check out our team info screen here in a little bit. But 14th in the bowl rankings, that's not bad. Now, I'm not going to bother with the top 25 polls. That doesn't matter anymore due to the bowl rankings. What we can do is go to the Heisman Watch. And there is Larry Williams, our sophomore halfback. He is moving right up the list. It's crazy to think we may actually win the Heisman with this guy. Now, you got to remember in that last video, he became an impact player. Halfway through your season, you may have a player get an impact status or you get may, may get moved to somebody else. It's always right in the middle of the season when a couple of things like that can change. And that happened for him. He is now an impact halfback, and we are going to take advantage of it for sure. But it's really cool to see him in the top five and to think we got several games left to play. Let's go to players of the week. We can check out the national at least. Looks like a wide receiver from Purdue had a really good game and the defensive tackle. Out of Wisconsin, they seem to have a pretty good game as well. So the Big Ten got represented well that week. Let's go to conference standings. It's hard to believe, but I think we're going to win a division. This is our third season. I've been trying to win a division forever, and I think we can get there. Now, we've already beat Houston. They're 4-1 in the conference. We haven't played Tulsa yet, but they've already lost a couple games. Then the farther you go down, the more losses you will see. So I think we are in incredible shape. We got two games left. It is Tulsa and somebody else oh ecu yeah so it's ecu and tulsa that are left so as long as we could just win one of the two we should win the division and let's check out our team info screen our backup free safety he's been out pretty much all season uh we'll look at the offensive side he got stucky williams and cooper nothing has changed all season in that regard and you look over the defensive side stamper is still leading in tackles and now in interceptions he's really come on the last couple weeks in the interception department and then nixon is leading in sacks now let's go check out ecu see what they got going on looks like they have a center out today i don't know if he is a starter we will find out starting quarterback the drew kid don't we i remember this kid i think he's a dual threat 
I, I done a really small dynasty with ECU years ago, and I remember that kid's name. So I'm pretty sure he's a dual threat guy, but we'll check that out here in a little bit. Looks like they got a running back averaging almost 100 yards a game. He may be an impact player, uh, not a whole lot of wide receiver, and it looks like they got a bunch of random dudes on defense kind of doing their thing. And in their last game, they got beat by Central Florida. All right, I think I am ready to play the game. So let's go ahead and get into it. Now, again, as you can tell, this isn't live stream. Uh, I, I wanted just to play this uh, by myself on this one. Uh, before we head into the game, I want to check out their uniforms. This is their default. All purple, ooh, with the black helmet. That looks pretty cool. Uh, do they have an alternate? Uh, okay, so anybody on the next crew, the next team, can look at that right there and see that that is an issue that they may need to fix for their next patch. Uh, apparently, the alternate home uniform by default for ECU's got red pants. So we're definitely not going to go with those. We're going to let them go with their purple. But of course, we're going to control two lane. All right, this should be a whole lot of fun. Love to get another win. Looks like they got another player out as well. Probably a disciplinary issue. Um, we're eight. No, it's incredible. We got four games left. We got two non-conference games. We got Florida, Michigan State at the end of the season. So after this game, we'll have Tulsa. And we are back on the road. We are in North Carolina. Hey, football fans, Brad Nessler here with my partner. Been a long time since I've taken on the Pirates. Cool looking stadium. This is a good dynasty opportunity. I've always liked their potential. We got great weather for tonight. Greenville, North Carolina. These two schools from Conference USA. Win today, then we are a lock for the conference championship game. And here come the ECU Pirates. I think the uniforms look pretty cool. The helmet looks pretty neat. I assume they got a purple helmet that you could probably switch out with that if you do the next stuff. And there's Larry Williams. We're going to try to do some serious damage with him today. It's been a while since I've had an impact halfback. They're picking us to win. Let's go to the coin toss. And they won it, and they will. Uh, get the ball first. There is no win, so I'm not worried about that. Let's check out uh, their roster, see what we are dealing with. Starting quarterback, Dav Davin, Davin Drew. I think it's Davin Drew. Yes, 76 speed. His backup is 76 speed. So I don't know how much I'll blitz today. We'll just see how that goes. Impact halfbacks. They got two of them, so that tells me they're probably going to run all day. So this is going to be quite the challenge. This is the nightmare, nightmare scenario Going up against a backfield with a speedy quarterback with impact halfbacks. He's got some speed to him as well. Nothing at fullback, wide receiver. Not a whole lot here. A bunch of guys in the 70s. Uh, tight end. They got one guy that's just okay. He can catch a little bit. Look at their offensive line, 82. Uh, their starting left guard is out for the first half. He's a 78 overall. Their starting center is out. That is a big drop-off for them. Right guard, 78, and right tackle, 78. It's just a very average line with a couple of guys out. We need to take advantage of that here in the first half. Again, I think they're running 4-3. It's I didn't scout them. It's 70 and 70 on the edges, not much there. Impact defensive tackle, and his backup, his number two guy, is just as good. So we are not going to go up the middle a whole lot. Uh, we don't have a good advantage there. Looking at their linebackers, 80, 78, and 72, just kind of there. 82, 76, and 74 on the corners. Uh, a very terrible free safety. 78 speed. We're going to go after him some today. They got a pretty decent, strong safety. 82 overall, 82 speed. So their secondary, their defense in general just isn't a whole lot there. So hopefully we can put up quite a bit of points. Now they don't have a whole lot in the special teams as well. All right, let's get this show on the road. They got an impact guy on the left side. I'm going to try to kick it on the other side. Go over here. That's going way too far. I think I'm going to kick this one out of bounds. I hit the button too early, I think, which happens all the time. It's just kicking on Heisman can get tough in this game. They're going to get decent field position. I am. Um, we're going to have to go man for a while. I think they're just going to run all day on us. Hopefully, we can control it some. Contain it, I, I guess. Going draw, somebody stop it. There we go. Takes a couple guys to hit him, but he came down. I'm going to stay in nickel. That's our best lineup, more or less. So we're going to match speed for speed. Going back to a slot. 
100%. Just look at what they've done so far. Some very impressive numbers. Now, this is He's got all day to throw. Very, very Ooh. My cornerback just did not handle that one well. He was right in front of it and decided not, not to make a play. I'm going to stand, man. I think they're going to go right to the run game. That's what I would do if I was them. The Pirates line up with two tight ends. Let's see what they do here. Ah, there we go. I got a shoestring tackle, but he got five yards out of it. They're going four wide. I'll go nickel, man. Second and five coming up here. Ball on the 45 yard line. They're doing. I'm going to do something like this. I'm going to take a chance on the left side. Intercept that. Or not. So far, my secondary is playing like garbage at the moment. So that's Stanford. That's a mis matchup for them the, going up against a linebacker First and ten. This is the fifth play of this drive. that's what we're hoping that free safety coming in next year will help us out in that department good defense there by Smith I guess it just said he dropped it uh, they're going with a I'll stay in cover two man they're going one wide receiver but I don't really don't have the players to go 4-4 but it looks like they got two wide receivers out there ah good blocking everywhere six points it's way too easy and just like that they've scored just a very easy drive form good blocking everywhere good to see the toss play work just too bad it went for us so we're going to get on offense try to tie it up that's what we got to deal with all day. They're just going to run on us. We're going to have to hope for a turnover or two. And he hits the PAT. This drive summary is brought to you because that drive was just too easy, and our secondary didn't help us out either when they passed. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Let's see if we can put some points on the board. Sends it sailing down for you. Uh, I think I'm going to let that one go. Let's go after that free safety first thing. Let's uh, let me fix this really quick. Do that. Let's do a deep cross up. We're going zone, so we're gonna attack that free safety. Hopefully, go over here. Terrible throw. Sh just short armed it badly. Not a good throw at all. Uh, we could try. Let's do a speed option. Looks like we're going man dime. Doing that, I can make this a little easier for us, maybe. Bring him down. Ah, just a bad play. Linebacker played that one perfectly. So it is, what, third and seven? I'm going to try slot cross. We're going zone. We're going to have to do a rollout. Do something like this. Hopefully we can have some time to throw. Good deal there. Great play. There we go. Good job, Cooper. Can he go? Ah, shoestring tackle. Great play to Cooper. Great throw. By far his best throw so far. My left tackle made the play on that one, though. Was able to shut down that defensive end. Good spin. I normally don't do that, but I just felt the need to spin there. Uh, let's go. Let's do tunnel screen. We're going man 4-3. I'm going to go to Gibbons. I'm going to do something like this. We'll keep it simple. Pretty good defense there. Wasn't expecting those guys to be sitting there. Good play to Gibbons on the 4. We're going to have to... Let's do a screen. We're going zone, so I'm going to hit my screen. I'm going to hit Smith on this one. Good deal. All right, so we got on the scoreboard. We're going to tie this thing up with an extra point. Good blocking, everybody. That's a good answer to their touchdown. So let's kick an extra point. And figure out what to do on defense. I'll just do a hat on a hat. I'll stick with man. We're going to have to get a break or two. Right down the middle. I'll try to have a better kick this time. Pontiac. 
Well, they got an impact guy on the left, so I'm gonna try to kick it to the right. Hopefully not too far right. At least it's not going out of bounds. And the other guy's gonna catch it, but he's got plenty of room to return. Johnson takes it from the six. Can't wrap him up. Dude. Hopefully that'll come back. That could be a clipping. Yes, that is a clipping. We will definitely accept that. Get on their 12 yard line. Let's go nickel man, cover two. Try to keep them in front of us on this one. Going to pass again. I'm surprised. Oh my gosh. Almost got the sack. That would be pretty cool. I don't normally get sacks with defense tackles. So it's second and nine. I'm going to stay in, man. I think they'll run it here. Now, if they continue to pass, I'll, I'll go zone. I mean, they could pass all day. Fine by me, but I just I have a feeling they're going to run a lot more. There we go. Ow. Ah. Playing good at defensive tackle at the moment. So it's third and nine. We're going to go cloud. I, I'm trying to decide if I want to go after the guy or not. Well, we can go ahead and try it. This first time he's going to see our zone. Ah, oh, off the back foot. Good defense. Oh, I caught that. You got to be kidding. How lucky is that? What garbage play this is. How lucky is it? They're just making plays. That's all there is to it. A tip, and he still gets it. It bounced off his back. Look at that. How lucky can they get right there? All right. Let's go back and play some more man. First and 10. Ball on the 27. Oh, garbage play. Now they'll probably run it. Ah, oh, spin move. He caught me on that one. And there he goes, six points. Just like that. Again, this is what we got to deal with all day. Nothing I can do about it. I mean, just more running nonsense. My entire defensive line got destroyed. A broken tackle, and it's all she wrote. So it looks like we're going to have a high-scoring game. Hopefully, I can keep up with them. This may be our one bugaboo game where just, you know, nothing goes right on defense. Like I said at the beginning of the video, though, it's the nightmare scenario for their backfield. Impact halfbacks with a speedy quarterback. Let's see if Batiste can do something. No, nope, this is going to be Givens. My bad. Nobody blocked. Good job, everybody. Let's go. Let's run basic slam with Williams. We're going zone 4-3. Uh, right, we'll go right. Not a bad play. Pick up 7 or 8. I may stay here and we can run basic option. Man 5-2. I love the shift. Almost got stuck right there. He fumbled it, but we got out of bounds, thankfully. Good play by Stucky. Uh, what else can we try? Let's go. I want to get the ball to Williams some more. Let's go halfback screen. They're going man, so we're going to go to somebody on the left. Looks like we got an advantage on either side of those receivers. Great play there by Gidros. Not the best throw, but it was catchable. Uh, we can stay here to P.E. Reed. They're going man 4-3. I wonder. I don't know if this will help or not. Going cover two. We'll just pass this over here to Williams. Not bad. Pick up about eight yards. Uh, we can stay in this formation second and one. What can we call from here? Let me look. Uh, that the arrow. Uh, we could probably do tight end dig. For going man. 4-3. This will go to win. This will go to one of the impact guys. Let's put it that way. We'll go to Williams on this one. Get a first down there. How's he feeling? Is he feeling okay? Looks like he's feeling fine. Let's go. Uh, where's it at? Where's it at? Let's do QB choice from gun sprint. We're going zone nickel. I am going to probably hand this off. 
great play by Williams. Pick up a, almost a first down. We are on the on the 20, on the one. Uh, let's give him a bit of a break. Let's go option. We're going to get Ducre in here. They're going man 5-2. Do something like this. Looks like they're going cover zero. Had to pitch that one off quick. Somebody got stuck. I think my center got pushed back or something there. Good play, though. Uh, let's go back here and run some stick. Or going man. I'm just trying to think of simple ways to give to my impact guys. And looks like we're going to go to Gidros on this one. We're going cover zero, but we don't have a whole lot of room. And he drops it. I swear, Gidros. Just a bad play on his part. Let's go back and run option. Man, dime. We got the defensive tackle on that side, but they're shifting that way. We'll go to the right. Ah. Didn't get a block right there. Don't know why he didn't. One of the receivers should have got a block. Uh, third and four. This is interesting. I'll probably go back to tight end dig. Oh, they're going zone. Not what I was looking for. Let's see what happens here. First down. First down to the tight end, and that is six points. Great play. Good. I, we got a high snap, too. Somehow that didn't hurt us. Great play. So here, we'll break this play down. So we got, they're going zone. We got two zone beaters. Let me bring out my little marker here. We got a little dig route right here. If there's a big hole over the middle, above your center. And then we got pretty much a zig route coming over here. But there was a hole right here. So I just waited for it to get open. Snap the ball. You see, there's just a hole right there. I'm just waiting for that linebacker to kind of get out of the way. Then I'm just going to bounce to my tight end for six points. Huh. All righty. Good deal. We've tied it up. We just got to figure out what to do on defense. They're just running all over us as expected. We got to make better tackles. That's all I know what to do about that. Or we got to get lucky on a turnover. I may have to start thinking about running clock in due time. I'm not really ready to do that yet. And just another bad kick. Dang it, this is going to go out of bounds again. I hit the button too early. Again, I'm just, I probably need to quit moving that around until I get a better kicker. I just don't want their impact guy to make a run on it. So they're going to get good field position here. Uh, let's go nickel man. All right, everybody, let's make good decisions. East Carolina sets up in the eye. Going triple option. There he goes. Fullback making a play. Easy first down. He's not your ordinary fullback. This guy can move. You bet he can. I like this. I am. Um, I'm going to do a zone blitz. I don't know why. It's just on my mind. We got to do something a little bit different. Hopefully they don't run it. Ah, perfect play. I swear. There he goes. There he goes. And I had to go all the way around to make the tackle myself. Otherwise, that was going to be six points. And here they come. All right, end of the first quarter. We're tied. Offensively, everything looks good. Defensively, we can't do anything. Maybe we can fix that in the second quarter. Let's go back to man, try to keep everything in front of us. Do something like this. I got completely pushed around, but I was able to make the tackle. I'm making plays out there. Really cool. Let's go nickel man. I think they're going to run it again. Do something like this. Ah, there he goes. Easy to, easy first down. Dang it. Went half back direct on it, didn't they? Or did, is that what they did? Nope, they went off tackle. Ah, uh, what, what do you do? Everybody got pushed. Back to defense we go. Did somebody get a push up front? Good open field tackle by Ralph. That's what, second and something, second and 11? I'm going to take a chance. I'm going to do another zone blitz. Maybe we could get them in a really third and long. 
Please don't run up the gut. Or to the left. Pass. Ooh, that should have been picked off by Stamper. Good defense, though. So it's third and 11. We got to get a stop here. This would be huge for us. Maybe we can force a field goal. I'm going to go after him. East Carolina comes to the line. Only one man in the backfield. Hopefully those tight ends don't get in my way. Drops back to pass. There he goes. And now he's going to Good job, Bal. So they're going to kick a field goal. You can have as many as you want. Good job, defense. That's what we want to see. And that's when you turn to Old Spice don't fake it. They got a pretty awful kicker, but I assume he's going to make it. Yeah, way easy. So let's get on offense, and we can get our first lead, hopefully. And gain a half a possession, more or less. Pretty good kick. Batiste may have a chance with it on this one. Not a bad return. Get it close to the 35. Uh, let me think. What haven't we called? Let's go here, here. Uh, we can try speed option. Zone dime. Ooh, and they're shifting like that. I guess we'll go this way. Good block right there. I'm just going to keep it. Just get a safe first down with Stucky. We are on the left hash. We can stay here. Uh, let's let's flip that. Let's do halfback screen. We're going man 4-3. We'll go to somebody on the right. Cover two. Good throw to Batiste. Pick up five yards maybe. Second and two. We can pass it again. Let's go gun normal this time. Let's do Y stick. We're going man. We'll go to somebody on the outside unless. Is that a matchup we can exploit? Let's go to somebody on the left like that. All right, we're going to cover one. Get a first down with Gidros. Uh, let's go under center for a little bit and run some stuff with Williams. I don't, he needs a touch. And they're going zone dime. I kind of have to go to the left, don't I? I don't have to. Let me, let's do this. Let's bring this guy over. See, this helps at least a little bit. Let him get set. Ah, just fumble. My best player. My best player. What's, golly. Just garbage. That's all it is. How unlucky can you get your best player decides to fumble it? That's how you get beat. When your best players, your best receiver drops a pass, your best running back impact player fumbles the ball. East Carolina comes out with two tight ends. Somebody needs to make a play. To the Picks up five yards there. They complete that play action pass. Good for seven yards. Uh let's go nickel man. Second and three. Ball right around midfield. They'll probably run it here. East Carolina comes out in the shotgun. Almost went off sides. First down. Don't think he got it. They're going goal line. Let's go dog blitz. Let's see what they're going. They are going to the left. They flipped it. And he went way too easy for first down. It's just going to be a long nine, unfortunately. And again, I think this is one of our bugaboo games. We're just, it's just not meant to be. I hope I'm dead wrong on that. But you're due for at least one game like that where you just really got to tough things out. I'm going to go quarters. And they decide to go goal line. Oh, we got lucky on that one. Good job, a stamper. Second and 12. I'm going to go quarters again. I think they're going to pass. A minute 41. Defensive backs moving in closer. Another half back to Rick. I swear, uh, stuff like this makes you not want to play. You know, just more half back to Rick. Oh, geez. Two straight plays. Exact same play in a row. That's why I don't mind calling it. If they're going to get easy yards like that, 
I should be able to call it myself. Of course, it helps if my halfback doesn't fumble the ball either. So we got a minute 33. The best scenario here is to score a touchdown before half, get the ball back, and then score another one. That's easier said than done, though. I'm going to let that one go. It's too deep cross up. It did not work the last time. Just a bad throw by Stucky. Not a big fan of that shift. Let's see if we can. Good throw. Much better to play. Good job, Stucky. And it's first and 10. Uh, let's go wide receiver curls. They're going man. They're blitzing everybody and their brother on this one. Uh, what's I'm going to have. Oh, he can't even hear that, really? My best receiver can't even hear that? All right, we'll go to Batiste then. Oh, dang it. Oh, very lucky that wasn't intercepting. Perfect defense. They blitz everybody and their brother. Uh, let's, I'm going to go call the same play. Now they're going zone. This is probably a mistake. We're falling apart. I hate it. He got stupid stuck again. Stuck, stuck, stuck. Third and seven. Ah, this is too bad territory for me. I'm going direct. And they're going zone nickel. This ain't going to work. Gee whiz. Watch them call perfect defense on this one. Did not get the first. Dang it. I'm not worried about the clock. We got to go for it. We're going to get beat. We're on the verge of getting beat anyways. They're going man. Can Gidros make the play? It should be a very simple catch. And he made the catch. Good deal. And a face mask to boot. Nope, they didn't call it. We're on the 46. I am going P.E. Reed. They're going man. Let's see what they call here. Cover one. Go to Gidros. We need to get a, we need to get a timeout. Yeah, let's call a timeout. 33 seconds, first and 10. I actually want to run the ball. Let's go option. We got to get Williams the ball. Hopefully he doesn't turn it over again. Get a block right there. Nope. Good pitch, though. We're going to get six points. Good job, everybody. All right, so we got back in it. Good block by our fullback. I may have to reward him later. So our goal here is to survive the next 27 seconds. And then go to half and try to get the lead in the third. Do something like this. I have no clue what to expect. I don't know if they're going to try to get yards out of this next drive. I'm going to kick this right down the middle. I'm, I hate kicking it out of bounds all the time. Do something like this. But their impact guy is going to return it, and this is what worries me. This is why I try to kick it away from him. And just like that, he's gone. I told you. I told you. I told you. That's why I stay away from him. But, of course, he makes the greatest play ever. Uh, they're going to score on us, aren't they? I'm going to do his own blitz. I'm going to just go after him. Hope for the best here. Perfect pickup on the blitz. And they still make the catch. Of course they do. Their offense is playing perfect football, and we got a player hurt. I don't know how we're just down three. It's a miracle, honestly. Just, I hate to say our defense just played so bad some games and so great the next. It's just goofy, but whatever. Maybe we can get an interception here, force a field goal. There he goes. Good job. Somebody on the front line got to stop. And they're going to go hurry up. I think they're going to kick the field goal. Yeah. It's four seconds. Just force the field goal. That's fine. We'll go special teams. And we're going to go field goal safe. Man, just in case they fake it. I don't think they will. So we're going to go down six unless this guy can miss it. Ah, oh my gosh. 
Poor defense. Well, at least we stopped him, I guess. Miss it. Miss. It. No, perfect kick, of course. All right. So we're down six. One second to go. It could be worse, I guess. I don't know. Just our defense just played so poorly. It's a shame. It's no fun to watch. I'm going to let that one go. One second. We may get lucky, and I can probably... I could probably try another deep cross up. Set up shot at the Defensive end's coming back. That's good. Okay, we're going to have to. Oh, dang it. Wants to throw yeah, okay. That was a really weird play. They went cover three on me. I didn't know what to really do there. But we got some yards, but it don't make a difference. So we're down six and a half. We're going to have to play better defensively. That's the key. It's very, it's very simple. We got to do better because right now they're just doing whatever they want to on offense. Their quarterback is playing well, but they already got 200 yards rushing. I mean, they're on the verge of putting up 400 yards rushing, which I think is silly, but it's video game. It's, it is what it is when you got impact halfbacks. We got one bad turnover. Uh, the rest of that don't say a whole lot to me. I'm going to go to individual stats. Stucky, I think, is playing pretty well. 14 to 17, two touchdowns and no picks. Williams would play better if he didn't turn the ball over. I mean, it shouldn't happen, but it happens to us. It is what it is. Uh, wide receivers, uh, Gidros, uh, Cooper's leading in yards. Touchdowns, Wright and Smith. I don't think anybody was expecting that. Defensively, everybody's kind of sharing the wealth with on tackle front. Tackles for loss, Nixon's leading there. We got one sack and no interception. So let's head back into the game. Let's see if we can get a, a lead. The game, so be we have to half. get some points on this drive. This is our one chance to gain an advantage on the possession front. Good job, Batiste. Good job, Batiste. Good job, Batiste. Go! Ho, ho. No flags. No flags. No flags. No flags. Wow. Who's thinking that that was going to happen? We'll take it. I'll take the points however you can get them. Just a great play. He didn't get touched either. Wow, awesome. Okay, so what we got to do, I've said it all a hundred times, it's defense. We got to figure out a way to stop them, force punts, force turnovers, and force field goals. And he tacks on the extra point. So with under five minutes left in the third quarter, our score to lane. I'm going to kick it away from that impact guy. Last time he touched it, he took it back 50 yards. Much better kick. Kicks it off. Going over to this guy. Johnson fields it in the end zone. Good stop there. We get about the 25. Uh, one thing I do need to check. You go to in-game strategy. No, not in-game strategy. I want to go to stats and scores. I was looking at their ratio. They are running the ball a lot more than they're passing. That's what I expected. All right. So that's what we're going to continue doing our thing. Go back to playing man. Up a point. Who are going to get the ball to, you think? Probably that 27. There he goes. There he goes. There he goes. There he goes. There's just... Again, this is what you got to deal with. Everybody gets a push. Everybody gets a push. Um, I'm going to do a zone blitz. I'm going to just throw something weird at him. I think they're going to put up some yards anyways. Maybe we can get lucky here. Nope, they're going run. And there he goes. Another easy 20 yards. He's already got 200 yards. It's it's ridiculous. And they're 2-5 and five on the year, but it don't matter. Let's go, man. Cover two. It's first and 10. Ball on the 41-yard line. They'll work from the shotgun. Going to pass. Open field tackle by Gibbons. Uh, let's go man cover two out of four three it dang it it said they went too wide now they're going three i hate when it lies to me good job bail i was able to get around the guard so it's third and down can we get a stop it's third and five i am going to do the spy we're going to drop a hey, this guy's been running on third downs I hope uh, they may run the ball. We're going to just do something like this. Half back to Rack, you idiot. Oh, great stop, Smith. Now, they're going to go for it, I think. 
Ooh, they're going field goal. You can have it. Great stop, defense. That's what we want to see. Force those field goals. But they went half back correct again. This kicker, let's see if he can. Yep, he got it. Just another kick. Good, good kick. So now they're up two. But we forced the field goal. So we got to keep scoring touchdowns. I'm still not worried about running clock. I just don't, I feel like we're doing okay without having to bother with that. Let's see if Gibbons could do something. Nobody blocked. We are on the left hash. Uh, let's do a basic slam with Williams. I'd like to get him going as long as he don't turn the ball over. Uh, let's go to the left. Just nobody block. Nobody. Uh, we can stay here. We can run option. They're going man. Going nickel. This impact tailback would love nothing more than to have the ball in his hands right now. Just bad. Man, we're going to get some yards, but just not, not enough. Just not a good play. I pitched it too early, I guess. I don't know. It's third and five. I hope they go man. And they're going zone, so we may not get the yards we need on this one. Oh, jeez. Let's see. Thank you, Stucky. Dang it. I got a punch. That's a stupid, terrible pass. Well, there went that wasted opportunity. Completely blew that one, of course. So now here's their chance to go up two scores. A broken tackle. Ah, it's just so frustrating. I just hate seeing my defense play so terribly. And then my offense not showing up when they need to. Gun spread. Please don't go half back direct. Going man. Bad throw. I think the guy stopped or something. Second and ten. I, I'm going to go man. I think they're going to run it. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 33. Going gun trips over. East Carolina lines up in a shotgun. Half back direct. Somebody stop him. Stop him. Good job. All right. So it's third and seven. Just about three yards there. Got 214 yards. That's ridiculous. Man, if we can get a stop here, that'd be great. I'm going to do something like this. I think I may go after him. Intercept that. Ah, route. Good stop, I guess. Would like to get that thing picked off. So we're going to get the ball right back somehow. <laughs> so it's been a defensive battle so far in this quarter. Well, I guess I scored a touchdown and they got a field goal, but the last couple of drives have been defensive oriented. Uh, somebody get a... No, 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 no. Just don't fumble it. All right, back on the left hash. Uh, let me think. I'm going to call triple wide receiver option. They're going man. I'm going to see if this will work. They're going cover zero, too. Can we get a play out of it? Good play with Gidros. Pick up 14 yards or so. First and 10. Let's do something simple. Let's go halfback screen. We're going man. They keep calling man every time I've called this play today. We'll go to somebody on the left. Cover zero. Let's get it, Cooper. It's all you. Ah, uh, what do you do? Just a drop. Second and 10. Uh, let's go speed option. Zone 4-3. Uh, I hate seeing our defense struggle over stupid stuff. Let's go to the left. And he's gassed. He is absolutely gassed at the moment. And a face mask. Thank you. Man, that was a gift. We needed that one badly. So Stucky is really gassed. I, I can't run the ball much with him for a while. Second and four. Yes, we'll take it. So where are we? Are we on the left hash steal? We're on the right hash. Let's pass the ball, I guess. 
They're going man. Uh, let's try cover zero again. Let's see if Batiste can handle it. I'm going to let him handle it. Just, it's just not our night. I mean, it, it just isn't. So it's third and four. I'm going to do halfback to Reg. Watch him go zone. And they're going zone nickel, of course. And they're going to spread out. Ooh, they're going to do that. Maybe that'll help. Let's do something like this. Good block right there. How does it feel? <laughs> How does it feel? Ah. All right, first and ten. Oh, uh, let's do halfback screen. Out or going man again, so we're gonna go to somebody on the left. Cover two. Good play, yeah, Dros. I was, I, I didn't want to say anything. I was hoping he'd break a tackle on that one. Good job though. Second and two. Uh, let's just run the ball. Second and two. Man 4-3. Go to the right. Nah, just nothing. Just nobody blocked. Uh, third and one. I think I may do a toss on this one. Hopefully this will work. I'm not a big fan of that shift. I'm just going to toss it, though. Make that one a little bit easier. Six points. Got to get around him. He's got just enough speed. Oh my gosh, so we're up four. We probably need to go for two on this one, don't we? I am going to go for it. I think that's the wise decision. Let's go halfback screen. We're going zone. So what we're going to do is something like this. So now it gets us up six. I don't have my little two-point conversion chart to see if I should have went for that or not. I don't really know. Either way, we got our two points. <laughs> All right, let's go. Back and play some defense. This is a really good kick. Really good kick. That's where I won it right there. By far his best kick of the night. So we're up six. Let's just keep doing what we're doing. Our defense has really done a good job the last couple of drives, I feel like. Start this drive at the 20. We're going the gun spread here. Watch out for halfback correct. Well, nope, they're doing that. Good stop by somebody up front. I think that was Smith. I'm going to go man again. I think they're going to run it. Uh, we'll do something like this. Oh, went the other way. Dang it. Dang, there he goes. And there he goes. Easy 20 yards. Uh, okay, there's one more play left in the quarter. Uh, let's do... They're going dive. Or they're going four wide. We'll go quarters. I'm just curious to see. I kind of hope they throw it, to be honest. Play it. Nope. Up the gut. And another broken tackle. Another 15 yards. All right. End of the third quarter. We're up six, but they're just on the way to scoring again. Unless we can somehow get a stop. Oh, ow. I, that's just my fault for not making a play there. He got five yards on that one. That was 100% on me. I was right there to do something, but couldn't. Let's see what he does here. It's made or not. Just don't bother tackling. I swear, people. It's not that hard. Look, at he's averaging 14 yards a carry. Just ridiculously stupid. I'm going to do a zone blitz, just throw something weird at him. Because I think they are on the verge of scoring. Maybe we get lucky here and I can get to him. Nope. Another easy run. I have to make a, the tackle. And I think they're going to run the rest of the way out. So we'll just go man cover two and... Try to keep everything in front of us. Try not to look too embarrassing as he gets a touchdown. Good job, Al. Good job, Al. I was able to get around the guard. Or was that the center? Third and three. Uh, I'm going to go man. I think they're going to run it. On the 12, and they can smell the goal line. 
watch him go halfback direct on this one. The Pirates line up with four nope. He jukes him. And he still gets his first down. Bell brings him down. And it looks like Just run, run, run. I'll tell you what, Brad, that is I would do the same thing. I don't blame him, honestly. Just give it the 27 every play. I made the stop. <laughs> I dove way too early. I didn't really mean to. Uh, just a wild play there. All right, uh, we'll do something like this. Halfback toss, touchdown. Ooh, no, he didn't get in. Givens got to him just in time, but now it's what? Third and goal on the three, and they're doing... We're going to do the all-out blitz. I know what's coming. We're going to flip it. Are they going to do off-tackle to the left? That's why I call that play right there. So they're going to go for a field goal? Nope, they're going to go for that. They're going to, we're going to call the exact same thing. They're going to probably go with the exact same setup. Here, I, ooh, I don't know what they're going to do on this one. Halfback direct. Big play! Huge! Huge! How's it feel to not have halfback direct work for you? Man, that's a big play right there. So here's what we're doing. We're going to run the ball. We're going to run some clock. And if we can just get some first downs and end this thing, that would be great. Huge play right there. Now, what worries me here is that defensive tackle, but we got to round him, thankfully. Get a first down with Williams. Good play there. I am. I'm going to do off tackle from Gun Bunch. We're going to let that clock run. Oh, my gosh. We may come out of here alive with a win. Just don't turn the ball over and get a first down or two. Let this clock run. We're going to just go off tackle. Let's see if we can get some decent blocks. I love how they shifted. That's going to help. Snap the ball there. Good defense. That guy stayed at home. Second and seven. Right, let's do a toss. They're going man dime. Who is doing what? The green wave. Go into um, formation. I'm going to go to the right. Let this clock run some. I may keep it with Stucky, too. It just depends on what they're going to do here. Stucky, yeah, we'll just keep He's feeling okay, I think. Get a first down with Stucky. Now they're going to start calling timeouts. Good play, everybody. Good job. So now what we're going to do is I'm going to go gun spread. I'm going to go halfback dive. Oh, I forgot about their defensive tackle. I better be really careful here. The clock has stopped. Nothing. Nobody blocked on that one. Second and ten. They got one timeout left. Let's run basic slam. Zone 4-3. Uh, that's a hard shift to one side, so we're going to definitely go to the other side. Go to the right. The clock has stopped. I just no, just good defense. I had nowhere to go. The guy got around our tackle. I tried to get around him like that way. That didn't work. And they got one timeout, and they're doing third and fourteen. We're going to. I'm going to do slot cross, and they're going man. This is interesting. We can't get the first down with Cooper. I know that much. He can't hear that. I'm going to get everybody out of the way, and I'm going to run this with Stucky. i got to force them to burn that timeout. Ah, oh, they're doing that. You... Uh, this could be a crazy play. <laughs> Game over. <laughs> wow, that's actually... They played great defense there. I was not going to go over the top, but I did. I just saw them open. Well, open enough. By far the biggest play of the game right there. Incredible. Go back. So let's go back and look at this. So I'm doing a lot of hot routing. I got everybody pretty much on a go just to get out of the way so I can have Stucky go over here just so I can run a little claw, get down somewhere, and force their timeout. Maybe even get lucky and get a, uh, a first down. But that didn't happen. They went spy on this guy right here, so I can't run like that. So when you 
snap the ball. Oh, it's the defensive end who done that. You see, he's all over me. I probably could have outran him. I, I don't know. I don't know if I could have or not. It'd been really tough. But they went cover one, and for whatever reason, I just saw Gidros, but I didn't see this guy right here. So I just got lucky on this one. That's all there is to it. And Gidros was able to make by far the biggest play of the game. Not even close. Incredible. Stucky, stucky, stucky. Wow. Whew. 51 seconds, and that is game right there. We are going to take a knee the rest of the way. I can get to it. QB Neal. Oh, so we survived it. Like I said a couple of times, this is probably one of, going to be one of the games where just defensively it was going to be a struggle. But we got through it. Oh, gosh. We should be able to run out this clock. We only got to do it, snap it, what, maybe twice. But we got past it, so we are still undefeated. Somehow, some way, I thought our defense just played a whole lot better than the third in the second half. We just kept them out of the end zone for the most part. Kept their halfback kind of contained as best she can. All right, that's the last one. Ah, oh my gosh! All right, great win. Our most important win of the season. If we would have lost this one. We would have had to have beat Tulsa in order to win the conference or the division. Otherwise, Houston would have won it unless they would have lost another game. We don't have to worry about that now. We have locked up the division with this win right here. 36 to 30. All right, let's check out some stats and scores. 460 to 398. It was just an offensive battle for the most part. They had over 300 yards rushing. Uh, they didn't run. They didn't throw the ball hardly at all. They didn't have to, but we had to throw the ball quite a bit. Uh, we done a good job on third down. I'll take that any day of the week. We had that one turnover by Williams, that really hurt us. We go to individual stats. They're running back 288 yards. He had three touchdowns. He had only five broken tackles, which surprised me. I get he was really fast. He was able to outrun most of us. But the key here was we really stopped him in the second half all right let's go and check out our stats 16 and 22 for stucky two touchdowns 282 yards no interceptions running the ball williams ended up with over 100 yards he had two touchdowns it looks like he had a great game overall he just had the one bad play uh receiving we or gidros is our leading receiver 103 yards he led in receptions and yards and he didn't get a touchdown right and smith got those uh, you look at the defense, Smith, our middle linebacker, led in tackles. Uh, Stamper and Nixon led in tackles for loss. Only one sack, which is by Nixon. I, was that for me? I don't remember. And no interceptions. But you go to the box score, this was the key. They had 14 points in the first, 13 in the second, but only three in the third, and nobody scored in the fourth. Who was expecting that? It was just an offensive affair, affair in the first half but just very defensive-oriented in the second half. All right, let's get out of here. Let's head back home. Oh, my gosh, great win for us. Just that's what winning teams do. They find, out, they find ways to win. It's good to see our defense really step up in the second half. All right, we're going to sim the rest of the week. Let's pick this. We're going to speed this thing up. We're going to look at some scores for the top 25. And then we're going to look at our next matchup. It should be Tulsa. Tulsa beat us last year. So I'm looking for some revenge this season. And we got a bye week. There's nothing you're going to miss there. So I'll simulate that for uh, the next game. Because our recruiting is already done. So we're not, again, you're not going to miss anything there. Uh, what we can do is check out the top 25 scores for the week. Of course, we beat ECU. Louisville, Tennessee, Oklahoma. Then he got uh, Purdue got upset. Uh, Virginia apparently got upset by NC State. Florida State got upset. Then he got Miami. Then he got Florida, UCLA, uh, USC, Texas A&M. Then he got Colorado. Uh, no, Texas Tech beat Colorado. Virginia Tech won. Oregon State, Nebraska. Then you have Missouri uh, getting beat by Iowa State. Ohio State, then you got Michigan. So there was a couple upsets in there. 
All right, in our next game, we got Tulsa. They run like a 3-3-5 defense. Looks like they're they're five and four, but they're not doing anything well defensively, but they're or offensively, but their defense looks to be really stout. 16th in the country in total defense, 14th in Russian defense, 43rd in pass defense. And we back out the same amount of talent. Looks like we got just a little bit more than they do. But we're ninth in the country and we're still undefeated. And we're on our way to a magical season. But we got to get past the hurricanes first. All right, come on back. And I'll talk to you later.